Hey, this is Chris Yang and welcome to Maverick Next Gen. What I'm going to do today is to show you how I've solved my, my son's overheating problem with the Xbox One X. The issue that I found looking at solutions is the ones that are out there don't seem to solve it. And there's lots of things on the Amazon star pointing, say, yeah, it fixed it, but actually reading into it, it doesn't read it. So here's my solution. And I'm going to show you how I've gone and looked at the problem and solved it. And I'll... So this is um, Tsunami Gamers set up. Giving a quick shout out to my boy, Tsunami Gamers, William and Matthew. Please check out their link in the um, little information card at the top. Thank you. Project Scorpio edition. And the recent edition of Fortnite seems to not on my, my other son's Xbox, but this particular one, the Scorpio edition, it, it overheats, the fans kick in, and this is without my custom fan deployment, the fans kick in and you get that screen, that black screen saying, sorry, your, your, heating, your Xbox have overheated and you must stop and let it cool down. That doesn't help for the gaming experience. So you want something that will take the hot air away quickly. I'll show you now is this, look, Ladies and gentlemen, what we have here is, can you see those two 40 millimeter fans? If I show you the top here, I'm just drawing away what I've done. Oh gosh, and I can feel the heat already. What have they been playing? Don't want like So all I've done is literally created an aluminium plate, and I'll show you where I got that from. Cut a few choice um, sections. I mean, you can see it's rough and red. I just literally used some scissors to cut this out and bent it using some pliers. They're high powered, they're five volts. And... Anyway, I'll leave you the stats so you can have a look. But what I've done is I've literally, if I can find it, um, I have a sheet of aluminium like I always have handy I, I cut that plate that rectangular plate out as you can see there then I bent um, cut two more sections out well not cut I just cut these um, lines here one two three four bent them using uh, these pliers and then I drilled holes using a drill bit and a hand drill, just a regular battery operated job so that I can put screws in here. And I built, and I bent that at 90 degrees, which is a size 40 millimeter because it fits snugly underneath the HDMI air, air extractor places. And the, the principle is you need to create a lot of airflow to get that hot air out. And that's what those fans do, those two high powered fans. Now, the reason why I went for those two, because they were the best specification and they they basically extract the hot air as quickly as possible. And this really blows quickly, actually. So if I show you, it's already connected to the two USB slots at the back. All right. So, front, so where's one? Hear that? Let me just go and put my mic closer. Can you hear that, guys? And so what that's doing is drawing the hot air from here out to the back. But I thought, you know, let's take it a step further. And because this is aluminium, it's heat conducting. If you now add it to the, underneath the box there on top of the defrosting plate, this defrosting plate acts as an, a heat dissipator. And so what's happened basically, guys, is I've created something really good, better than the products out there, I believe. And what was happening, like literally, three times in a game, one of my sons, William, he was playing Fortnite, where the you get that screen to say, no, sorry, it's overheated, you need to wait till it's cooled down and restart. He now, literally, I bought, I put this solution in place back in the end of January, and it's now the end of February. He's only had, literally, he's played every day on Fortnite, and he's only had one incidence where it, it's got too hot. A curtain over there, I think my son put the curtain um, on top of the fan so that the heat can be extracted away. That's pretty much it. So you come up with something like this and it, every time you just need to remind your kids um, to to put the um, switches up to high to maximize the airflow. And I do love the the coolness being pushed there actually. I'm just, just wondering if I can get some sort of a 
an indicator actually is there yeah there you go that's blowing nicely yeah that's fully on can you see that okay anyway switch them off so ladies and gentlemen if you liked what you see uh, please click on the subscribe button and hit that notification so you can get more and I am going to do another video on uh, more I suppose little tips and tricks for the tsunami gamers channel so stay tuned have a good weekend bye